uh, when you've got, sorry, one player, uh, you get an amazing eight cards. Two players, you get six <laughs> cards. Three players or more, you get four cards. Numbers. Little... I've got, sorry, I've got numbers to letters. Ooh. So Ooh. Every, yeah, everyone must discard all the plus, plus cards. Assistant plus five, go bye bye. Oh, and Jeremy, when you discard the plus ten to this or plus twenty to that or whatever, then um, draw uh, the same number of cards back again. And I've got a play immediately, which is effects of a dissolute lifestyle. Um, Yana doesn't affect, don't, doesn't affect yeah. me. <laughs> Yana, <laughs> wait, no, is it only for you? Only for me. For okay. All right. Everybody might want to use the uh, the discard pile to be able to tell which cards on top. Yeah, it doesn't oh, yeah. affect anybody. It doesn't affect anybody else. Got it. Because I was going to say, Yana's character is a fucking prime candidate for that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, what's that one? Oh, rocket launcher plus twenty. Bye bye. The woman with no name is uh, fucking uh, as big of alcoholic as Alex Kinley is. So, yeah. <laughs> Does anybody now the letters to numbers was to draw draw more cards, wasn't it? You you discard anything that gives you like plus ten, plus five, plus twenty, whatever, and then draw the same number of cards as you discarded. Oh, yeah. okay. I, did, I didn't read the You end. didn't read it? You just lost your shit? I was like, I wonder why Yana's only got one Yeah, card I, I just wanted to confirm because I noticed Yana hadn't drawn additional cards. And I was thinking, did I? Was I supposed to draw more cards? Yeah. Or is Yana supposed to draw it's, more cards? It's Yana. It's <laughs> writing. She, she's more into the talking aspect, and thank God for that. So Okay. Yeah. Sorry, Guy. No. Oh, I, I think I... So I I was supposed to draw two more cards and I, I draw three. Of course. You suck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not good. Uh, All right. Now I've got a. Does anybody have a retrieve card or anything of that nature? Nope. No. Okay. Yeah. So I've got a insta hero. Mm. Well, actually, how how are people's um hero points at the moment? I'm well, good. Inst Insta I'm good. hero, you got to play it immediately, though, right? Yes, but I've also got a retrieve card, which I could trade to someone, so they could then retrieve it if yeah. if somebody's hero mm -hmm. points was low. I'm By the good. way, um, Jeremy, this welcome to uh, Pete. He is your crash course in how to uh, fucking play this game. All right, so I'll play <laughs> the problem solve. I'll play the Insta hero, and then I'll play the retrieve to give myself. Two hero points. Uh -huh. uh, and just as an aside, I've also got a limited retrieve, but you can't use that on Insta Heroes uh -huh. on hero points. But if people have got a good card, I'll, I, I've got something to retrieve it. Like a replenish or something. Yeah, if it turns out that we want something back. All right. Done. Right. Um, everybody, uh, please uh, make a note of whatever, what all is on you, and anything that would be destroyed easily by water, just mark that shit off. Oh. <laughs> so, like, guns and stuff? No, guns are, guns are fine underwater. If but you... the ammo in it? Oh, well, it depends on what kind of gun. Are you? Do you have the fucking uh, uh, bite them open and dump the shit in the end type guns? <laughs> I have yeah. a rifle and then I have a revolver, it was, I think. Oh, you got old old Westy oh, type yeah, of yeah, shit, yeah. don't you? <laughs> right. Um, the guns are still good once you clean them up and stuff. The ammo is the only part that's not good. Yeah. So you can still use them as an effective club mm, as you my, all start out underwater. Smartphone waterproof or no? Oh, hell no. Those things are just waiting to fucking feel a drop of rain so they can explode. <laughs> All right. So we'll see how things go here. Yes, your kookeries are fine there, Pete. Yeah. No, I was just thinking about my papers and... Um, oh, those will dry out eventually. Yeah. And the... Well, like, 
like Yana, I've got ammo from the Beast King West. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the those um, yeah. Uh, actually, the the uh, cartridges do have paraffin wax on them and stuff. So yeah, you can you can like uh, uh, make so like uh, I've got to dry them out. Yeah, I'd give you a luck roll for D10 uh, bullets or whatever uh, for each different kind of bullet. And if you make a crit, then you can have two D10. Yana, that means you're going to roll two bullets if you get a crit on your thing, which you're not going to. But um, before you're even able to start worrying about drying shit out. Logan, I have another question about equipment. Uh-huh. Sword, do I have one on me? Uh, it, was, it, was it in the... Um, What's it called? Uh, the did you? Um, um, trick I don't it? know. So I had one. It? I had one in there last at the end of last session. But then yes, then okay. yes, absolutely. Congratulations on uh, uh, keeping a sword in the sword trick holster because that's a good idea. <laughs> good okay. Question to ask. Mm -hmm. I said good question to ask. It is a lovely question to ask. So, uh, you guys are all underwater. You're not sure where you are or wherever. You're, you each detect that you have two buddies close by who are also underwater. Nobody is fucking happy. Anybody with a lot of gear, let me know. Like pistol and rifle and like a small backpack or whatever. I'm not worried about more than that. I am worried about. I have chain and about, what am I carrying now? About three thousand dollars of gold coin. Uh, how many? How many? How many kilos is that? I told you how much that shit weighed. How many kilos is that, Pete? Um, I think from memory that would be about a kilo for the. Yeah, no, that's what... that's that's okay. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, was it was the chain the uh, butcher's chain mail? Yeah, yeah, it was the butcher's okay. chain mail. Butcher, yeah. all that, all of that stuff. The the. Uh, um, the uh, fucking heavy gold and the butcher's chain, because butcher's chain is fucking wondrous stuff. Negative 10 on your swimming. Yeah, That's nice. it. If you were wearing regular chain and had gold bars, you'd be fucking drowning right now. But mm -hmm. you guys are underwater, and you, you're you having a little bit of trouble seeing. Uh, you're not sure which way is up or which way you're positioned or anything. It's kind of darkish down here. Um but give me spot hit and rolls lower is better to collect information on where you're at now. And none of you did the take a deep breath thing because you didn't know you'd wake up underwater. Oh, no. I was on the boat the last time. I really you must have uh, fallen through, you think? <laughs> yes. Surprise. Well, I was in the rigging actually, but yeah, um, by half. Long fall. Okay. Uh, right. Uh, Yana, did you just make yours? Yeah. And Jeremy failed? Yes. Excellent. Jeremy, you have no clue what the fuck is going on. You could be upside down for all you know. Uh, <laughs> Yana, you can tell that the surface is that way. You're kind of on your side. Mm -hmm. Yay. <laughs> you are literally upside down, but you've spotted a couple things. First, you know where the surface is. Second, you know that one of your buddies, who you don't recognize, is beginning to panic. And mm -hmm. third, you think you see a distant shark. Okay. Lovely. All these things just <laughs> beep, 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 beep. And also um, nearby is like a underwater. Have, have you ever seen those slides with the, uh, the, the uh, cover over them so the kids don't fall out on the sides? Yeah, yeah. There's one of those. And in fact, it looks like there's a creepy underwater wrecked playground here. And that, that slide thing caught your eye, and then there's like the fucking swings that are kind of floating and stuff. And it, it's salt water, is your guess, judging uh, by these. There's no, no sign of a boat or like yeah. anything to grab hold of up no. at the top. But it, you're not that far underwater, and the the bottom is not that far either. Okay. More than enough to drown in, but you're well, guessing will, the water is like. I will. Right, I will write myself and try and get the attention of the other two in point. All right. Uh, go ahead and give me a, um, a signaling, signaling. roll. 
<laughs> the R2 look at you blankly. <laughs> Both of you guys give me signaling as he gestures wildly. No problem. He, uh, You see him go, <laughs> and he's starting to fucking disco, and you're not I, sure I will, what it all means. <laughs> I, will, I will actually spend a hero point on that because I don't want to cause a PC to drown. <laughs> you're disco dancing. I was going to give you a dance roll next. <laughs> nah, well, I got I got two hero points at the start of this game, so I might as well blow one of them. Yeah, yeah that's better. Uh, did, how did the air team do on their signaling rolls? Fail again. I mean, okay. it's pretty. It's a pretty obvious signal. I'm doing that. It, yeah, but he's he's busy panicking. You can tell he may need some extra help. Yana, what are you doing? Uh, I think I just try to go up. Give me a swimming roll. The, if you fail it, it, let me know by how much, because you're basically just trying to use buoyancy. Pete, mm. one of your buddies seems to be panicking, possibly facing the wrong way, can't see anything, possibly has a fucking seaweed draped across his eyes and is thrashing around. What do you do, mm -hmm. Pete? I will try and grab him and orientate him. Uh, right. If you if you'd like to try to pull him up, you can do it, but it'll be an additional negative ten on your swimming to just drag him to safety. Are you willing yeah, to no. risk the negative twenty? Considering my swimming, <laughs> no. You can do it. <laughs> right. Uh, he's trying to point and stuff. Uh, give me a spot hit and roll, Jeremy, to at least follow the pointing finger and stuff. No, no, it just shows the seaweed is wrapped around his face. He's like, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Bubbles are coming out. Pete, you're thinking, he's going to die soon. <laughs> I'm going to roll a spot or a hero point on that last one. Damn I'm going to die here. Uh, oh, blah, no. blah, blah. He grabs the seaweed and he's trying to pull it off his face and it's actually an octopus and it's got its tentacles. You don't have any cards that can assist at all, Jeremy? Nope. I got a bunch of nadas. Uh, okay. the, the only thing I have is a vehicle chase card. That one's not going to do us any good. He's yeah, doing breath for it. <laughs> I have skill 15, but I don't know if I'm close enough to trade cards. Sure, you can <laughs> stick your face in the water and go... Uh, yeah. Can I try another swim, or is that do I just blow another well, you, hero you can point? Try, you can try a swim. You just don't know which way is up, and the seaweed's all over your face like a I'm, garbage I'm gonna, bag. I'm gonna blow another hero point. Hey, finally a success. Blow uh, eighty. You see, just some guy like pointing up, no emotion on his face at all. Possibly he's got a pipe in his mouth. I'm not. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> he looks totally relaxed. <laughs> he points yeah. upward. Uh, right, right, both of you guys give me swimming rolls to break the surface, please. There we go. No. He points and watches. He waves goodbye as you swim up toward the surface. Okay. Do I <laughs> notice him lagging here. behind me? Pardon? Do I notice him lagging behind me? Yes, big time. All right, can, you, if, I, I want to make an attempt to try and pull him up with me. Give me a swim at negative 10 to be heroic and shit. Got it. Woo! Lovely. Well done. <laughs> Thank you. Are you are, is McKay bald? No. Ah, then you grab him by the hair and drag him up to the surface. <laughs> Excellent. That was the closest thing to reach. You knock off the deer stalker cap and grab his hair. Yeah, I was going to say, no, I probably don't have my tap. No, we're, we went out into the wood. Yeah, I wouldn't have had my top hat on, so no. <laughs> Yeah. All right. So you guys break the surface and stuff. Now everybody, uh, give me a spot hit and roll. Success. If you if you make it, then give me like uh, animal lore or some skill like that where you know about animals. Uh, zoology slash animal lore. Yeah. yeah Success. Mm. This animal lore is coming in very handy. Yep. There are a lot of animals in the world. All right, um, so who all made their spot hidden roll? Me. Me. You guys see the shark fin over there. Who made their animal lore roll? Me. I did. You guys are thinking it may just be curious at this point, Me. you know, because nobody's bleeding yet. Now, if you wanted to, to slice into your palm and shit, you can see what a feeding frenzy is up close. But I right took now, my knife. 
<laughs> so speaking of bleeding, the damage and whatnot that I had in the previous session, do I still have it? Oh, good question. Give me a willpower roll. You want low. Congratulations to a stat roll right the fuck away. Is anybody else wounded? No. No. Yeah, you're bleeding on the water and shit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Okay, forget what I said about just curious. Go with the rest. <laughs> um, now, there's just the closest... I would um, clarify. <laughs> Take a card for reminding me you're bleeding in the water. I like that sort of mission. <laughs> Um, you guys notice that the air is super clean. Um, now, it seems to be dusk, and I'm going to need a swim roll from everybody because the shark is definitely heading toward you guys. If you if you don't make your swim roll and your name is Pete, let me know. Otherwise, you can flounder your way over there. <laughs> um, when When we broke surface and... Sure, right over it. there. It's not that far. Right. Thank you. That's exactly that's what I was going to ask. Did not we actually notice any land? You're you're getting so scared of a shark, you may just jump up out of the water and run across the top of it. <laughs> no. Pete begins to kick and flounder to try to make himself more attractive to the shark. The shark's like, oh god, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, right. The, the you guys go into a bit of standard combat. Hopefully, you'll be. Able, did anybody make their swimming roll? No. No. Everybody's just <laughs> floundering around, wanting to fight a shark. I like that sort of initiative. There we go. Uh, let's see what happens to this fucking poor shark. Heroes are first. Pretending you're a dragon is approved. <laughs> right. Uh, you guys are first. Yana, what do you do? Wait. Um. <laughs> Can I punch the shark? Uh, you wait to punch it until it gets close. As soon as it gets close, you're punching it. What do you do, Jeremy? Uh, I'm going to try and swim away from the shark. Good. Give me a swimming roll, Pete. What do you do? I'm going to grapple the shark if it closes on me. <laughs> right. Uh, it closes. Uh, that's its round. Yana, give me a punch. Pete, give me a grapple. <laughs> uh. You make oh, the, you made oh, the no. shore, Jeremy. Uh, I pull out my pistol. It's just or do I have to stand up? Running out of it, you're like, ah, oh, that's not good. Yeah, I make my <laughs> I make my grapple by half. All right, you you you've got it, Yana. Did you fumble one of your rolls there? Yes. You've got your fucking fist as far down its throat as you can get it, and yes. you're hoping it doesn't bite. <laughs> Next round, it gets a huge bonus to bite your arm off. Literally off, okay? There's a reason I grappled it as opposed to trying to take it with a knife. <laughs> oh, she wasn't even doing that. She's just... Like, no. <laughs> He's fucking violent. I saying what she was going for. You know, the old punch a shark in the snout mm. thing they talk about. Yep. Unfortunately for Yana and her arm, uh, the shark is first. Heroes are second. Okay. Making fun of the shark is approved. <laughs> the shark simply closes its mouth, attempting to rip off Yana's arm. Here we go. Because I've got the shark grappled, can I do anything to prevent Prevent Yana. the jaws from closing with the fucking force of a crocodile yeah, prevent, jaws? Yeah, prevent it losing your arm. Uh, no, you're thinking that anybody sticks their arm in a shark's mouth to try to prop it open or whatever, All right. you're not going to have that shit long. I have a like the gate card, so I maybe... <laughs> yeah, well done. <laughs> Let's see if you're going to use Perfect. it. Yes, you're going to use that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Big the shark. Oh, actually, in this, you don't have to. It, it only um, rips yeah. it up really bad for three three ah. real points of damage. Yeah, three points if I got gotten more than ten damage, I was just going to have the arm pop right off. That's okay, then. <laughs> oh, all right. You like the scars. What yeah. That which does not kill you only makes you angrier. And right, Jeremy, what kind of pistol? Where did you get your pistol? Uh, twentieth century. It's a, it's like a nine millimeter. Oh, you got like a Glock or something? Yeah. Yeah, those can fire underwater. Actually, police have tried that, much to so, their unhappiness. Now, the bad thing is that both the other people are literally right next to the shark. Your chances of hitting them are is actually better than hitting the shark. I noticed that after I pull out my pistol. Would you like to make fun of the shark? 
<laughs> yeah, I, I think I'm going to taunt him and get a card. Let's hear it. <laughs> uh, hey, fishy, 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 fishy. <laughs> <laughs> no, take, take a card, yes. Uh, right, and uh, Pete, I'm guessing you just want to keep your amazing steel grapple on it? It's not I'm going to try and attempt to steer it towards the shore. Uh, right, if Yana would get her arm out of it, that'd be a big help. Yana, what are you doing? Uh, what do I roll to take my uh, arm out of a shark? I would be happy with with a, uh, a strength roll right now, or dex. You're either trying to slide it out or force the jaws open. Ah. Mm -hmm. No. You you uh, can feel stuff inside, and you're like, yeah, I wonder if I if the, maybe there's a toy price in here. Ooh. The shark is like, hot damn, I'm going to get that fucking arm. It's doing that. Arr, arr, arr. Pete, as far as moving the shark to shore, remember that you are seem to be the weakest swimmer ever. So pretty much all yeah, you're doing now is talking about. I was more talking about, because I've got it grappled, maneuvering its tail or whatever, so it heads in that direction as opposed to swimming well, it in that direction. Yeah, it's, it's, it. it's really not even moving that much because you've kind of gotten a so yeah, well yeah. grapple. So right now it's actually suffocating because sharks have to keep moving. Yeah, that's right, know? yeah. But that's but, what I mean. But having it so, it, if it moves, it will be moving towards the shore. Yeah, and you're thinking, take me, take us to the shore. You are you are the laziest swimmer ever. <laughs> um, right, no problem. Oh, Yana, you lucky girl. Heroes are first, villains are second. So, uh, Yana, would you like to try again to get your yes. arm out of the fucking mouth? Yes, please. Open the mouth. <laughs> No. No, no. She's like, come on, I dare you. Um, Pete maintains his hold. Uh, Jeremy, you're standing on shore. Why are they doing that? It looks like they're basically getting ready to gangbang the shark from here. It's not a pretty thing. You're like, oh, my mother warned me. Uh, would I be able to get – how difficult is that shot? It's pretty fucking hard. Everybody will be very impressed if you can make that shot. I'm not going to tell you negative, but it because they're, they're not just holding still. Everybody's rolling and thrashing around and stuff, and there's big sprays of white water coming out. And you're pretty much just shooting into the middle of it, hoping you get the shark, <laughs> which is not that big of a right. shark. If it wasn't frenzied with the bloodlust, it would have never gone out after anyone. You want right, to take uh the shot? Uh, I'm going to drop my pistol, pull my sword out, and go back into the water. I don't know how much of that I can do in one turn. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, as you're as you're pulling out your sword and getting ready to go in, you notice that there's shit going on on shore. Over there seems to be some sort of like it's fairly distant, maybe like 100 meters away, some sort of palisade thing. And there's something over there. I will show you a picture of. You can only see it uh, from the back right now. Uh, Did I make the pictures too? Oh, there it is. And reveal area. Burp. This is the shape of it. Uh, what is that supposed yeah. to be? You don't know, but it looks I like do. it's the size of a large building. Pete, I know you, you, you just write write down on a piece of paper. You can hold up to the camera in a bit what you think it is, Pete, if you are correct. I can't, I can't recall what the name of it is, but I can recall. But I'll, you, I'll write down. I'll write down something. But yes. Yes, write it down. I'll give you a refill if you got it right off of that little of information. It's about the size of a two-story building or so, uh, irregularly shaped, as you can see. And it appears that, like, uh, between it, because it looks like it's out in front of the gate, maybe ten meters, and there's weird psychedelic colors of lights and shit. And you see the, the gates are open and a bunch of blank-faced kids are coming out of the gate oh. and heading toward the, the building thing. Meanwhile... Uh, I, I also kind of remember something like this. Uh, <laughs> yeah, his memory. <laughs> She's like, I'm in the Matrix. I said, I can't remember exactly what it's called, but I remember... Well, if you can write down to enough to convince me that you knew it, then I'm happy to give you that fucking card. Um, Let me know when you want me to flash the camera, I will, but not yet. Uh, yep. Oh, the shark gets to go. It, Yana, did you get your arm out of its mouth? Um. Yes. Oh my god! 
Now it now it's going to be attacking at negative because Pete won't let it go. It bites the fuck out of Yana wow. scoring a critical hit and mauls the shit oh. out of her as Pete's attempting to resist it. It only does a massive 19 points, possibly what? turning her in half. <laughs> I will negate that. All right. <laughs> You're thinking that the arm would have been better. Yeah. No problem. It barely misses her. Uh, Jeremy, were you wanting to still wade back into the water with your sword or hang out on shore and watch the scene unfold? The, how well Yana's out. The other guy, I'm gonna wade into the water still. All right, and we now go to the next round. Heroes have a chance of getting knocked down. In Pete's case, if you take any damage, which you are going to be taking off of the shark skin, because as I know Pete knows, shark skin is fucking nasty as shit to touch the wrong way. Um, so if you take any damage, you have a chance of getting knocked down. Villains are second, right? Hero's turn. The shark is unwounded and triumphant so far. Yano, what are you doing? You finally got in your... You're, you're thinking if you try punching again, it'll just eat your hand. Yeah. I think I may try just to swim away. Give me a swimming roll to get away from the shark of death. Oh, no. Pete, I need a strength roll to hold on to a shark as it's freaking out. And they're yep. super strong for their size. Uh, where's my strength? There's my strength. Now, if you make it, then you're you're trying to aim it. So we'll go with yes. we'll go with that. It will get you closer to shore. No. Ah, this is Pete well, being like to... No problem. I uh, it manages to toss you off of the shark. Jeremy, give me a swim roll to get back over to the shark. I really wish you was just on the shore with my gun now. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> right, I made, See how made it to the shark. All right. So, uh, and Yana, did you say you made your – no, you failed your swim roll, didn't you? Failed. Mm, nice. So you're all three hanging out with Sharksy McShark Shark, <laughs> McShark Face. Indeed. And it, it, it's pretty much biting in a blind panic. On a one or two, it bites Yana. Three or four, it bites Jeremy. Five or six, it bites Pete. It wants Pete. It was it was angry with him holding on, and it pretty much just makes a big snap at him. Ooh, it only hit for normal damage that time, but it does do a eight points of damage. Damage reduced by one die. Uh, no, that's only for that's only for uh, the Highlander zone. No, because I'm wearing chain. Oh, you lucky bastard! But while well, I'm negative 10 for swimming, and it does, it does more damage. <laughs> it does more damage, yes. It, it, I, it, it gets a purchase on your chain mail, I'm afraid. Since with my current damage, that would send me unconscious, so I am spending a hero point. Are you sure you wouldn't like to be unconscious with a shark? No, I <laughs> think I would grab and I'll get be in the shark's mouth unconscious. Damn it. All right, we now go to next round. As you guys continue fighting the shark which was just going to passively inspect you until it caught the smell of blood. Heroes are first letting out a battle cry instead of doing anything else gets you a card. Don't forget to be pulling cards at the end of each round. So, heroes are first. Yana, what do you do? Quick. Swimming away from the shark. Run, she says, run, run. I'm drowning. Help me, Jesus, I'm drowning. Jeremy, what do you do? I, I well, slash at it with my sword. All right, you're definitely not at full on this because, uh, you know, sword. In water. Yeah, water sucks for swords. Spear is good. Or trident, hence Neptune. I could stab with the sword, then it's essentially a spear. Yeah, sure. Give it a shot. Um, but, you know, you, if you miss by enough, you may get to stab one of your buddies who's flailing around because Yana's right next to the shark trying oh, to nice. place it to bite her. Oh, my I God. It. You critted it? Yeah. Just nice. roll some damage, sir. Uh, actually, I roll D. What's D eight usually? D eight is the normal uh, damage for sword. So yeah. two D eight in your case. Boom, boom. Twelve damage. The shark is really fucking unhappy now. It looks pretty wounded. Another shot like that, and it'll be pretty fucking dead. And then a skinning knife later, and it'll be pretty boots. So anyway, Pete, what do you do? Yana's attempting to uh, uh, entice it to bite her. Uh, Jeremy's stabbing at it with his sword. Uh, I, will, I will quick draw my knife. 
Go for it. Yes. All right, now the critical question, is this a low magic zone, a high magic zone, or a non-magic zone? This is a non-magic zone. All right. Did you you mean... can tell by your knife damage, bitch, you're saying. Yes. Um, <laughs> oh, it's that, right. uh, oh, it's not a kukri, got it. It looks like yeah, uh, some no, sort was... of dagger. Yes, yeah, so I was drawing the dagger. I thought I'll give uh -huh. that a shot since I haven't used it before. Right. And it turns out it lets you down. Yes, it does. All right, I'll stab with it, not not knowing until I stab with it as to what the outcome is going to be. Mm -hmm. Yep, I hit without a problem. Roll and your no D4. Magic. Yes, it's a D4. Yay. One point of damage. Mm, you say. Yes. <laughs> no problem. I'm going to roll random to see it attacks in its fucking biting frenzy of um, biting this. It goes for Jeremy this time. Woo! Woo -hoo. He loves it. Apparently, stabbing it with a sword is a sheer way to its... Ah, oh, damn. It, it just, like, right next to your head. Big chompy, chompy, chompy. <laughs> fishy, fishy, fishy. <laughs> yeah, it heard that, apparently, so it, it's, still, <laughs> it's still angry. We now go to next round. Heroes are first, and something weird happens. Right. Mm, you guys see that the... Uh, uh, Two-story building in the distance is leaving the ground, and you hear, Oh, the good of us all. And then it twists, and you can see that it looks like this. Ha. Hold up your thing, Pete. <laughs> can you read that? Yep, Zardos. So, yep, uh, go ahead and refill your hand there, clever boy. So, uh, and then it seems to be floating away. It goes up in the air and begins going off toward the south. That's unusual, you say. And <laughs> um, you do see a couple of blue boxes fall out of it, like turds as it goes. So, we now go to back to the round. Right, you guys are first. Um, Yana, what do you do? You appear to be unable to leave the uh, uh, shark. It shows that uh, your feet have got like those six uh, six pack holders, the plastic things. <laughs> You've gotten one through each ankle and stuff. So uh, oh, no. maybe that's thwarting your swimming. It, it has to be something like that. Yeah, I try it again. People just aren't cutting them up like they should. Do you think? Oh, I made it. I made oh it. Oh, my God. She, begins to, <laughs> she, she goes to the shore. Shore is only one swimmer all away. This is not that far. It is literally <laughs> rock throwing distance. Jeremy, it's your turn. What do you do? I attempt to stab the shark again. Ah, he says, I am winning. And Roll your D8. Oh, sad wow. And Pete, it's up to you and your tiny letter opener. Yep. <laughs> uh, Unless you want to drop it free action, then fast draw a proper knife. Nah. Oh. That's not a knife. Great. <laughs> Holy shit. Roll your 2d4. Five hmm. points. Much more respectable. The shark is now heavily wounded. Uh, let me check and see what it wants to do here because it's. Uh, Really low is go back to biting. Really high is run away. Yeah, it it swims off to like go and think about things. It seems to not like the it, it's it's drawn. It, it swims out, but not too far away. You can tell that it's really wanting the blood, but it's really in a lot of pain. So next round, you guys can give me swimming rolls and shit to try to avoid more of this shit. All right, and. Hang on a and I just, yes. we're, are we out of combat? No, this is the last round of combat, and anything okay. you have to roll for, like Jeremy just did with swimming, is approved. So you get a card for it if you can make it. Hell yeah! Mm -hmm. Sorry, I was just going Yana, to. If you, can, if you can think of a skill that you can do and make a roll for and successfully mm -hmm. roll, then you get a card, Yana. I empathize with the shark. You do what? <laughs> 
empathize with the shark. <laughs> I'm very good at it. <laughs> I see. Did you make it? Yeah. You're thinking you'd like to bite people as well. Uh -huh. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Come on, Pete. Pete, it's all up to you. Can you ever yeah. escape the no. <laughs> So let me see what the shark decides to do because most of the things that were causing him pain have left. It begins kind of circling closer to Pete, like it's thinking about, oh, I could take it. And <laughs> Pete bleeds more. Hero, all heroes, minus one real hit point. Maneuvers approved. For those unsure, you can maneuver into a bare place to watch Pete get eaten. Or swimming is a type of maneuver. If you want to swim back out to try to get Pete and haul his fucking non-swimming ass back in. <laughs> Up to you. The shark is digging this. It's like, oh, just one hors d'oeuvre left. Yay! <laughs> and since he's wearing his chain, it really helps me to bite him better. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I, I see him dragging behind again, and I make a swim out to him. Oh, give me a swim roll. Oh, now there's two of us floundering. <laughs> <laughs> He's come out to flounder with you, Pete. You feel special. Oh, that's some good shit. I maneuver to find a better view. <laughs> what are you doing? Yana? Manu Maneuvering on the ground to have a better view. You're up on a rock going, this is fucking fantastic. I get to see all these fucking people. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and Pete, did you act all right? Did you, did you die with the minus one more real hit point? No, no. Uh, so was the shark within melee range or it's not that close yet? Not yet. Not yet. But it's, it's right. doing the, I'm thinking about biting your ass again, Swim. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Coming back, yeah. you know, it's going to do one of those pass bys and shit, maybe, or maybe I'll just turn and bite the fuck out of you. You're not sure. I'll try swimming. Well, it can't be any worse than your other couple swimming rolls. That's right. I'm waiting for you to fumble and just. Oh, okay. yes, I know. The <laughs> peak dives underwater. He decides swimming underwater towards shore is better. Well, yeah, I'll just try get to the bottom of the. I'll just get to the bottom and walk to shore. <laughs> yeah, you really wish that would work. Um, <laughs> All right, so now we go to the next round. It, it appears that Pete's trying to make it harder to... Uh, heroes are first and their allies flee. You have no allies. Attack is approved. Ooh, the shark is not quite in range as it's swimming around. Plus, Pete's gone underwater, so he can go off to die by himself. So, heroes are first. Jeremy, would you like to swim underwater to try to get near Pete? So when the shark comes to eat him, then you can try to, like, sacrifice yourself in the shark's mouth or whatever the fuck it is you do. <laughs> I'm going to try and retrieve Pete. Hey! One. Right. He swims underwater, <laughs> he snags Pete, and you're both on shore. And the shark's like... <laughs> just swims off like... Now, now, had you, it, yeah. mm -hmm. now you can what? shoot the shark. Ah, but I don't have any bullets. Ah. Well, you could you could try with one of the uh, ones in your pistol, but it will make a great deal of noise unless it goes squish. Yeah, I don't do it. No problem. Um, you hear, a, which is probably fortunate that she decided not to combat, and you hear a great deal of wailing and commotion from the um, uh, stockade town over there. But it does not appear that they've seen you. They're more doing the wailing like somebody just took all their kids wailing as opposed to the uh, let's kill the new people wailing. So is this the same place I was here? I was here already. Is it, is it the same place? Do I remember it? I doubt it. <laughs> 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 I'm fucking mean. I know. Um, yeah, yeah, it may be vaguely familiar. Mm -hmm. It looks like one of those walled communities that they turned into a palisade yeah. type of deal. My question was if it's the same town we were before or is it a similar town? No, I think you're on a no-brainer is what I'm thinking. Yeah, okay. Yeah. That's what you get for not being able to tell Logan ahead of time. You get to find a shark and then be on a no-brainer. See? Yeah. You see how it is? So... <laughs> 
<laughs> well, I didn't remember the one photo you sent me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, right. Anyway, you guys are looking at that. It's looking at you. <laughs> Don't forget well, to. Oh. This can uh, go down oh. to four cards. Yeah, reduce Trim. your hand back to four. Oh. Uh, that's over. To six. It's, it's a little. It's a little chilly, but it's not too bad. Um, all right. uh, hello, I don't think I've met either of you two before. Ah. <laughs> That's all she said. Hi. Okay. <laughs> I'm um, Joshua McKay. I'm Phil Poulter, as I pick up my gun and put it back in its holster. Mm. Interesting. And you are, ma'am? I'm quite happy we are out of the water. Yes. <laughs> What's your name? What shall we call say, you? What, what is your name, or do I just say, hey, you? I don't know what we are talking about. Look, weird place there. <laughs> what do people refer to you as? Oh, I'm scared. <laughs> You're scared. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Can I empathy yeah. that? <laughs> sure. <laughs> um, do you want me to try and Aww. bandage your arm? Oh yes, please. <laughs> if you can. All right. You, I'll attempt you, first I, aid. I don't think you have anything that isn't wet with seawater. Yeah, I'm sorry, but just to just to stop the bleeding and stuff. Good luck. I, I, you're you're gonna be go for it at half because you have nothing, nothing good. <laughs> Basically, you, you slap some wet yep. stuff on there and go. Yeah, yeah, yeah just use go. some material to. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, is anybody familiar with this place? Um, Logan, I'm an. Is it that I'm on a no-brainer, so I can you can't use what I remember, or is it that we are again that like in a, in character I'm again in the same place? I'd have to go with in character you're in the same place. Okay. So go ahead, anything that you can actually remember, because I know your notes are shit. So <laughs> yeah, it's true. I'm not even worried. If Pete was here, I'd just be like, Pete, you're on the fucking no-brainer. Don't help him at all. But for you, whatever you want to tell them, great. I love it. <laughs> yes, I was here and I know exactly what to do. <laughs> All right. So, <laughs> Take your you card, yeah. <laughs> they look filled with hope and confidence. <laughs> this illusion. The most important thing about this place is that there is a gate nearby to a place where my girlfriend lives. Yeah. So we need to go visit soon. I didn't see her for a long time. I you guys see. see more sharks showing up, wondering where the blood beast is. <laughs> so what's to go with the floating giant rock? Rock? Oh, that thing. I don't know. It's boring. Okay, it's boring. <laughs> 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 you know, so, we got, <laughs> when I was here last time, it was quite a long time ago, and I don't remember very well. I remember <laughs> that there is a one one village here, and uh, like a bigger bigger city, long, long, long way away. Okay. And uh, there is some fun art community, and they give me beads. So yeah, nice. <laughs> and, and then there is this bandit who terrorized everyone, and I wanted to meet him, but they said the other people I was with said they don't like him, so we didn't go meet him. Uh -huh. And um, yeah. So, so is this another Saint Angeles analog? Is this another variation of I Saint Angeles? I don't think so. There is a gate to uh, to San Angeles, I think. Is it? Okay. Yeah. yeah, because my my girlfriend lives in San Angeles, I think. Yeah, I'm very confident about my knowledge. 
<laughs> which which version of San Angeles does your grandparents live in? As I've Girl? been to a couple of different versions. Uh, it's not grandparents, but girlfriend, and they live. Uh, she lives in uh, in the modern one. Oh, okay. Um, the in, Highlander one. No, the oh. futuristic one. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So, so not the movie one. No. Not the one where we're actors. No. Not that one. Not that one. The future one. Mm-hmm. Right, yeah, I haven't been to that one yet. Oh, All right. Okay. Um, I like the expression on Jeremy's face. Like, <laughs> my character just sitting off to the side. Like, what the fuck is going on? I I go to. You, sorry, go. I I go to Jeremy and like go really close and start to look at his skin. No problem. <laughs> out of yeah, my face, she... woman. Give me a give me an empathy roll, Jeremy. <laughs> fail. You feel better for failing. <laughs> I, I say out of my face, woman. <laughs> so, Phil, have you been to many of these dimensions, um, realms, whatever you want to call them? Uh, no, I've been to hell and I've been to San Angeles. That's it. Hell. Okay. Well. No worries. <laughs> Sorry, when you say San Angeles, as I, as I said, I've been to a couple of different versions of San Angeles, which ver as in modern day San Angeles or a Western was, version of San Angeles or. I was told to carry a sword at all times. And if I get uh, cut, it heals real quick. <laughs> yep. Yep. The one where we're all C grade actors. Yes. C grade. Did you, did you, that was so, I was so angry with and graded. They didn't recognize my talent. <laughs> <laughs> Did you cut your way up to B grade? I don't know how to use a sword. <laughs> <laughs> hey, ne neither did I. Which yeah. which meant which led to a very, very long fight where I used yeah. a knife to get by with a sword. <laughs> yeah, I, I was also in a similar fight. <laughs> Everybody take a card. This is uh, fantastic. <laughs> Meanwhile, the villagers, like, it shows you guys laughing and joking, and it cuts to the villagers. Our kids have been taken. <laughs> yeah. uh, the, the villagers, uh, they're mm. dressed in, like, blue jeans, flannel shirts, carrying bows, crossbows, spears. Um, it, basically, if you think of, uh, uh, like, Fallout, where they make uh, kind of stuff out of old-world junk, then okay. you're in the right ballpark with those guys. They haven't seen you guys either. They're so focused on their own problems that they failed to notice people like 100 meters away who are kind of, hey, how's it going with you? So was this, was this village friendly? Um, anyway, how old, is you, how old do you look as an aside? Um, kind of young, I guess. As in but... 20s, teenager? No, 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 like 20s, yeah. 20s, okay. Mm. If she was much younger, you'd have to keep her out of the deep south. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think they were kind of friendly, but there were some issues. Uh, I think they are like low-key um, worshipping the, the floating things, and they are like sacrificing people, but I'm not sure something like that was happening. Okay. Well, why, don't, why don't we head there so we can dry out and get our wounds tended to and Okay. Get out bearing, see what see what's going on. Well, see if they recognize you for a start. I don't know if that's a good idea. Oh. <laughs> did you did you do something that might have um annoyed them? Yeah. them? Yes, I think they I said something and they didn't like it, so Okay. Yeah. Well mate, mate well let let's play it by ear, see how they react to you. Okay. Um as I'm starting to notice some weird things about some of the places we've been to where it almost seems like sometimes the quests as such reset, but yeah. our effect on the world seems to keep going, mm -hmm. which causes some strange paradoxes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Which is two children instead of one elven child. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that Somebody be. I say suddenly dies and then becomes alive again. <laughs> yeah. You guys right, have, so let's, yeah, we walked that way. 
No problem. Pour, pour water out of our, out of my boots and. No problem. You guys get over there, and uh, the guards are immediately uh, uh, pointing bows and stuff at you, and going, oh, "They have they have rifles from the before four time." They look really alarmed and are backing away from you. Hi. Hello. You have not so died good. the blue fire death yet. <laughs> they look impressed. <laughs> no, no, we have not died the blue fire death yet. I would definitely get rid of those, those metal uh, rifles or else you will die the blue flame death. He looks around the sky. Oh, right. It's true. They told us that we can have guns here. She uh, says, bringing up yeah. a really vital thing a bit later. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to your first Yana briefing, Jeremy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, that death, I forgot. So, so who, who brings the blue fire? The, 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 uh, the aliens do. Okay. The ones that t- took over the planet? Okay. Some wild-eyed lady who, with tear-stained cheeks bursts out and says, they work for them! And everybody looks really like, oh! And then they look at you guys, and you're thinking, they've almost got a firing squad's worth of bows here. This is, could go really ugly. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. Actually, we, we certainly do not work for the aliens who bring the blue flame death. They're, they're with them. They, that's why they can carry the rifles without dying. Well, they haven't fired them yet. Maybe they don't work, says the guy. They're a witch, she says. Do you have any ducks? <laughs> <laughs> Just take a fucking card, yes. There's a long discussion about your guys' weight and your wetness and the ducks, and they weigh it, and... You guys are heavier than the ducks, so except Yana, who weighs the same. <laughs> anyway, no, they, they, uh, they 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 suggest at least covering the the rifles and stuff. Yes, um, but they want to know why you're wet and wounded. Uh, we were in the water and we got attacked by a shark. Uh, why were you in the water? Our boat sank. Mm, it's very reasonable, yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, where where did your boat come from? Are you are you from um, Bug City? No, no, no. We're from San Angeles. Bug City. Yes. Yes. We call it San Angeles amongst us house. Ooh, fancy man. <laughs> <laughs> is is there a a um? Inn or a tavern or a pub or a well, if you have place money, with... there's all those things. A pla- could you direct us to somewhere where we could dry off and get our wounds tended to? Yes, they cut to uh, right for one one of the twenty dollar gold coins. It shows you guys sitting in robes. Everybody's got their own cigar. Uh, Pete, the doctor, is. Uh, uh, attempting to bandage you right now, and you've got room board beds all there from one of those twenty dollar gold coins. Yep. The doctor, however, has managed to injure you more. Let's see, D three, two more points of damage, Pete. That'll be that'll that that'll keep it from festering. He says you just got to keep these clamps holding the wound open. That way, it can dry out. <laughs> Thank you, sir. He takes his part of the money and leaves, and you're like, I hate him so much. I'm not the only wounded person here. Oh, who else is wounded? He says. He swings around his butt. Yes. Let's hey. see what he does to Yana here. Do, 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 he says. Yeah. There you go. There's a fresh bandage. He says, bandaging the wrong arm. Anybody else? All right. Okay. And he leaves. <laughs> He's happy. He leaves. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's just the, like St. John's, you think. The Farking Gold, has that changed? Or has that still uh, got the same pictures no, on it? It's, it's still got the, the same pictures and stuff. Um, you're not sure how much it's going to be worth here or how much of it is gold, like what mm-hmm. percentage of gold or anything. But just keep track of it separately, yes. Eventually, you'll probably lose it to something horrible. That'll make us all happy. It's okay, the, those points. 
those gold pieces are about the size of uh, USA nickels, if you know how big those are. So they're much smaller than the fucking big ass twenty oh, okay. gold pieces, but they appear to be more goldish. But you know shit about metallurgy and stuff, and you have nothing good to test it with. If you did, mm -hmm. I'd make you happier. But they're tiny compared to the big fucking coins you got from the uh, yeah. thing. By the way, uh, you other two can make some spot hiddens on Pete's money if you'd like. All right. Let's see his money. Um, one of one of them has it looks like some unhappy fat dude wearing a like jester's cap. That's the small coin. The big coin looks like a constipated hedgehog on one side. And what was on the back side of those, Pete? You remember? Um, wasn't it the pears? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, pears. And on the was it a hedgehog side, or a lion? Wouldn't it have been lion? Yeah, you're. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Take card. Uh, constipated fat lion. Um, and then on the small coins on the back, um, probably uh, cards or something like that. 